We're both with Enphase Energy, and today we're here with another series of frequently asked questions. This one is focused on EV charging. We get customer service calls that people are inquiring about charging speeds. What are the kind of charging speeds and the things they should be thinking about when it comes to the time it takes to charge your car? So with a purchase of an electric vehicle, typically you are going to receive what they call level one charging station with the vehicle. The level one charging station, it plugs into your standard 120 volt household outlet. It can be very slow to charge. It will provide about four to five miles of range per hour of charge. Generally, people are gonna be looking into purchasing what's called a level two or 240 volt charging station. This will require a dedicated 240 volt line. And there are various power levels that are available within level two charging. But having this uh, type of charging installed can provide anywhere between 16 to up to about 60 miles of range per hour of charge, depending on the vehicle that's being charged and the station that they've purchased to charge that vehicle. So some cars actually accept power at a different rate than other cars. That's Based, correct. Okay. On every vehicle, there is a onboard charger. The onboard charging system is in complete control of the charge. The charging station is actually just a safety device and a pass through for power. So what it's doing is saying when a vehicle is plugged in, it says, this is how much power I have available to offer. And then the car takes in what it can up to the max of that charging station. So there's never any harm in having a higher power charging station or lower power charging station than what your vehicle's capable of. The car's just gonna take what it can up to the max of that station. With every electric vehicle, there is a different rating for the onboard charger. So what that means is that every vehicle has a certain amount of power that it will take in for charging. Some vehicles are limited to around 15 amps for charging, whereas some can take up to 64 amps or more. So the speed is going to really vary on the vehicle that's purchased and what its onboard charger is capable of taking in. Okay. If you didn't get your question answered today, email us at questions at and we'll be sure to get to it next time.